What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Got a special client interview today with my guy Harrison. Harrison's been in the program the last few months and uh, not going to see your thunder, dude. But why don't you go ahead and just give us a little introduction about you and, and we'll go from there? Yes. Uh, my name is Harrison. Um, I've played over eight years of professional baseball now and I'm still chasing the dream. And uh, in the meantime, like with my side time, I decided to start doing some remote training and uh, saw Nick's stuff on Instagram and had some buddies that had been in the program before and uh, knew it'd be a good fit for me to just get some guidance on really how to structure everything and to get people into my program. And um, so, yeah, it's been a great journey so far. Yeah, sweet. Sweet, dude. I um, I think it's been super awesome to kind of see you grow. Um, why don't you maybe tell me a little bit more about where you were at before you jumped into the program? Yeah, so before I jumped into the program, I was literally like just getting started. And like I knew I had the knowledge of like what to do. I just I didn't have like the content creation knowledge and like all of the the marketing aspect of it. So I started with like I think I had like 300 followers when I hit you up. I probably joined the program around like 300, 400 followers and I just passed 4K uh, like literally a couple of days ago. Congrats. And so, yeah, appreciate it. And so I've just gotten a ton more action. Um, like I haven't had as much time as I'd like to dedicate to it. So like I have a couple of people in my program right now, but I know like that this will transcend three months and I'll have people constantly coming into my program for years to come yeah definitely what do you um what do you feel like was maybe the biggest things that you feel like you got out of out of working with us a lot of guidance and a lot of structure on really how to market yourself for people to like get to know you to trust you to be willing to join into your program because that's like the biggest hurdle with online training is that people don't know who you are uh so like really like gaining likability gaining trust and really how to structure things to get people into your program so you could have clients and really help them change your lives yeah definitely it, i think you had like a pretty good idea of like how to create a program already you've obviously trained like a lot of different places what do you feel like on the marketing front like what do you feel like specifically are the things that you know, you, you learned, I guess, to go from like, let's say 300 followers to over 4,000 now. Really how to take the slack out of your content. Um, like really how to like organize and make your content be able to grab attention without just being clickbait, but to really like grab attention and provide the value rather than just like speaking like off cuff and just like randomly putting ideas out there. It really gave me a structure of like how to actually get people's attention so they can hang around and actually listen to the value that I have to provide. So it gave me like a good, just a good guideline of how to get engagement. Yeah, definitely. I guess in terms of like before you joined the program, like what were your expectations of like, let's say me, the team, the community, things like that? Honestly, I didn't really have any. I just kind of jumped in because I had had buddies that have had success in your program. And I was like, well, I mean, if they've had success, I could have some too. Um, so I honestly didn't know exactly what to expect, but I will say I do believe that it transcended any expectation that I would have had just because of how professional and how organized it was all put together. It's really broken down into simple, actionable steps and it has tons of value across all fronts of remote training. Yeah. I appreciate that. Yeah, dude. What, uh, what do you think was the overall, like, I guess like thing that kind of pushed you over the edge. We didn't even hop on it. Our first call, bro, was uh was the onboarding call. You were just like, fuck it, send me the payment link. <laughs> yeah, dog. Just hop straight in. Um so wait, what was the question again? Like, what do you think? What do you think like kind of pushed you over the edge? Like, why why were you able because like, dude, people get on like four calls with me and still don't trust me, you know? Yeah. Well, I think for me like 
I just have a belief system of you have to invest in yourself to get the best out of yourself. Like that's how I viewed my training. That's how I viewed my whole career. Like I literally have traveled the country and spent over 20 K on my own training. So I was like, I got to spend 3k to get in this program because it's going to make me 100k like it's simple math to me <laughs> i'm like yeah invest in this and you're going to learn how to make money for years to come it just seemed like it seemed obvious to me to do it yeah definitely and i, I think that's like a really good mentality to have bro you know because you like you don't have you know a hundred remote athletes and yet you still feel like you got tons of value out of the program. Yeah, for sure. Like I said, this is going to, I could last for years. Like I have a hundred percent confidence that I'm going to be able to constantly bring people in, especially the more time that I have to dedicate to it. And now that I've partnered up with Ty, it's like, now I have somebody helping me get people in the door. And it's just like, I think it'll just roll from here. Yeah. A hundred percent. hundred percent. What's, uh, What's kind of the plan for you moving forward? I know you kind of alluded to it right there. Yeah, so I just partnered up with uh, my buddy Ty, and we're going to – we've created the holistic pitching path, and we're basically just going to try to provide as much value as we can to athletes, pitchers, um, whether that's mentality, physical, like teach them how to actually train like a big leaguer trains and to really just see how good we can get them and – mentor and guide them throughout their whole journey yeah it's like that's sick what uh completely unrelated what comments do you have about that hat you're wearing manana baby yeah <laughs> this is a little san diego hat that i found yeah, it's, sweet. it's sweet what uh what would you have to say about like just kind of the your experience in the program in general like what do you feel like from an outsider's perspective looking in, like what can they expect? From an outsider's perspective, like you can expect like a highly organized, like very in detailed plan to get you to scale your remote business to where you want it to go. I mean, like whatever you put into it is what you're going to get out of it. So, I mean, the opportunity is it's abundant. There's a lot out there. Definitely. Definitely. What would you have to say to anybody who's been watching my stuff for a while in the shadows, not a hundred percent sure. Is this Nick Neville guy a scammer? Like, what is he doing? What would you say to them? <laughs> uh, Nick is a good dude. Uh, Nick is like a hustler. Like he's, uh, he really truly wants to help you. Um, I can tell you put a lot of time and effort into this and it shows through the program. So, I mean, like you're here to help. And I think that's obvious to anybody who's in the group. Yeah, I appreciate that, dude. Gotcha, bro. Is there anything else that you want to say just right now while we got the camera rolling? Um, let's see. Yeah, I mean, I just think your whole program as a whole is professional. It's highly put together. Um, it's kind of like the similar way that I view training is like leaving no stone unturned. And I think it's the same way with you. Like it covers every bit of detail that it takes to run an efficient remote program. And so I think it's awesome. Yeah, I appreciate that. I appreciate yeah. that, dude. I just want to say like, thank you for, uh, thank you for trusting me, you know, cause I, yeah. I know it's not easy. And, um, I think you can really, really help out a lot of young athletes. You know, I used to train pitchers. Um, I think you're way better suited to train pitchers than I was. Mm -hmm. appreciate it <laughs> <laughs> um if uh if somebody wants to wants to see your stuff and you know follow along with you like where can they find you uh francis pitching or you can go to my partner's page ty buttery we'll have a lot of collaborations together but yeah francis pitching on ig and uh we should have a website coming up soon hey. uh, it'll probably be the holistic pitching path but that'll be posted on francis pitching nice Nice. Well, Harrison, I, I appreciate you jumping on, dude. Thank you so much. Um, if you're a coach and you're watching this or you want to expand your training business online and you want to jump in the program, you don't even need to jump on a call like Harrison. Uh, you can just DM us on Instagram or if you need to talk to somebody, then you can book in a call with us down below. But Harrison, I appreciate you. And for all you guys watching, I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.